microphones. As many of you know, audio is just as important as video quality when it comes to video production, because if your audio is crap, no one's going to want to watch that video. And we always try to upgrade our video and audio setup here at MS Tech, and recently we went over a kind of an audio setup overhaul, and it consisted of two upgrades. One of which was the Sennheiser MKH416 shotgun microphone for stationary shots. This is quite possibly the best consumer grade microphone money can buy. Absolutely fantastic. It picks up audio just right in front of it. I might do a dedicated review of it. I'm not really sure yet, but I'm loving using it. And the other audio upgrade we went in is the Sennheiser AVX ME2 lav wireless mic setup. And I'm wearing it right now. It's underneath my shirt. Transmitter right here and a receiver behind the camera. And this is my full review of that wireless lab system. Dealhunter.tech is a website where I collect and display the best deals on tech from all around the web in one central hub. I update it every day with new deals, and I only choose deals on quality tech items. You can use the link down below to go check it out. This is going to be an interesting review because this is by far the most professional audio setup that I've used with this wireless functionality. So I'm not going to focus on the nitty gritty details like somebody a little bit more knowledgeable than me would. I'm going to focus on how this enables me to make videos differently and what it enables me to do. And also for reference, this entire video is re being recorded on the AVX wireless system. All right, for comparison reasons, right now you're listening to the on-camera audio on the Sony A6300. It's actually not that bad for on-camera audio, but now you're listening to the AVX ME2 wireless system, and it's a whole lot better. Let's take a look at the system itself. There are two main parts of this system, the first of which is the ME2 lavalier mic, which is just a microphone that you could technically plug into anything that accepts 3.5mm input. Then there is the wireless AVX system, which is what makes this product special. You plug in the mic into the transmitter, which is an included belt clip, and then that transmits the audio wirelessly to the receiver module plugged into an XLR port. That probably sounded more complicated than it actually is, so I'm going to simplify it. This is the lavalier, the ME2 lavalier mic. It's under my shirt and it's just attached using like this little magnet clip. It's somewhere around right there. It goes down and it's plugged into this transmitter, which is on my belt clip. And that transmitter is linked to this receiver, which is plugged into the XLR port of this recorder. And then that records audio to later be synced in post. And this whole system, though a little bit complicated, has a few distinct advantages. First and foremost is portability. I don't have to deal with any big recorder on my pockets or on my person. All I have is just this belt clip, and it gives me a lot of freedom of motion. I don't even notice I have a microphone on. Honestly, I could like play a sport right now. There is no interference on my body whatsoever. I feel very free, and that is a nice feeling to have, especially when you are mic'd up and recording a video. The second reason has more to do with behind the scenes stuff. So before, when it was a wired system, I had to use this, I had to set the audio level, set all the settings, and make sure I was recording correctly. But now with the wireless setup, that can be done by the man behind the camera, and then it can be held by him. And now this is especially useful when somebody doesn't know how to use it. So if you're miking up somebody other than like me who is involved with the production, it's a lot easier to just put the transmitter on them in the microphone, and then I'll be able to handle all of this stuff, and they won't have to worry about it. So again, it's kind of out of mind, and the person on camera can just focus on being on camera and the content at hand. And the third and final reason is audio quality. Despite being wireless and very portable, there's no noticeable loss in audio quality, and that's absolutely incredible. You can hear it right now. It sounds fantastic, even though I'm in outdoor noisy conditions. And as long as I'm within like 100 feet of the receiver with the transmitter, you'll be good to go, and the audio will sound perfectly clear and very good. Right now, I'm just a few feet away from the camera. So in this setup, honestly, a wired system would work just as well because I'm right there and I'm not moving much but I can just walk away and the audio won't turn bad because it's just transmitting it and the microphone is still on my system. I'm even turned away. You can still hear me the exact same. I don't know how far I am, maybe like 30, 30, 40 feet right now, maybe even more. You can still hear me perfectly and I'm walking away. And this gives you a lot of freedom when recording scenes. Uh, you can set it up any way you'd like and not have to worry about any degradation in audio quality or just not hearing it as well. It's not a stationary mic. So I could keep walking to the complete back of my yard and you can still hear me perfectly fine. Uh, it just really opens, up to, opens you up to a lot of opportunities with your creativity and you can do any type of scene you'd like. I'm really far away right now and you can still hear me perfectly fine. This is some mind blowing stuff. And you might be wondering, does it really make a difference to be wireless? Is it a practical feature as opposed to just something that you could buy and use it every once in a while? 
I had that same question going into this whole experience, but after using this in probably four or five videos in the last month or so, I definitely say yes to that. And the overarching theme there is freedom. I don't have to worry about anything when I'm on camera. I can fully focus on being natural, organic, and focusing on the content. There's no restriction of motion. I don't need to worry about moving and the camera not picking up my noise. I'm, I can safely feel like the audio is being picked up, the video is being picked up, and I can focus on whatever the video is about, and that's a very good feeling to have. That's gonna be it for this review. You've been listening to the mic the entire video, and as you can tell, it sounds very good. Even in the outdoor windy condition, it still sounded very good. And you may have noticed, I didn't mention any negatives. And that's not because there aren't any, but it's because for the tasks I use and the purpose I use this microphone for, there are no negatives. I'm sure somebody that uses the mic a little more intensely and aggressively could find a negative, but for my purposes, there is nothing wrong with this mic. It does everything I need it to do absolutely perfectly. Thank you guys for supporting the channel. Nice is the iPhone app where you can try tech products for five days before you decide whether or not you want to buy it. Right now you can get an iPhone case that's $15 that like holds stuff and cards in the back of the case in a little sliding compartment. Very cool stuff. And uh, I check out tech products from Nice all the time on the channel. Thank you for watching. Subscribe to see more content. And as always, stay classy.